Here we are with Jujutsu Kaisen episode 23. So yeah, if you like what you see, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think. And I will say, let's get to the episode. Yeah, I guess we go straight into the fight, right? What the fuck? He split. He spits blood. <laughs> well, it seems like Itadori has no problem with him. Isn't he special grade? Because he got fed with the special grade curse object, whatever. Ooh. No, you don't. <laughs> Poisonous? Like, acid? <laughs> Is this like whack-a-mole? <laughs> it's like whack-a-mole! Damn! Dude, the animation in this episode is good. Mm-hmm. Ah. Oh. This one. Oh. What the fuck? It's big bro. <clears throat> All right. Oh, it's like, oh. Oh, is this? No. <laughs> Dang, some strong nails. What the fuck is this? Yeah, exactly. So, do they want to get rid of the curse too, maybe? But why would they both leave then? Because the other one said last episode someone came before me or whatever? Uh. Or maybe they are after Itadori, I don't know. <laughs> I doubt it. Oh. 
on things dripping. Is this the main body? This looks similar to the one. <clears throat> so another finger. And it looks the same as the first one we saw. <laughs> So, I don't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> so, we have a curse here that is special grade that has a finger, I guess. And then the other two guys came in and are they after the finger or are they after Itadori? I guess they are after the finger, but why did both of them... But why does the other one that Itadori fought, why did he leave if he's after the finger, maybe? I, I don't know if I'm just dumb or if I'm just confused and it's normal to be confused at this point. <laughs> It seems weird. I don't know what they are after. Because on one hand, they are after the fingers. Because they want to give them to Itadori. But on the other hand, they are also after Itadori. So, I don't know. And so now they start to react. It's stronger. Well, gone is the blade. What I think is interesting is that <clears throat> since since Itadori and Sukuna made the pact, he never came out again. He never took over again. Dude, his eyes. <laughs> hmm. 
Damn. Okay. Damn. He got punished hot. Not long enough to be dead yet. Is this his ace up his sleeve? Oh, it's afraid. Oh, he has a domain too. I mean, does everyone has a domain or is it something special that you have to learn like a Bankai and Bleach? Ooh, is Megumi a bit split personality? <laughs> Where he has like one calm side and one side that is full of rage or some shit? I mean, it would make sense with his backstory that he like beat up people in school, right? In middle school or whatever. So, where's Nobara and Tadori? Okay, I guess he sensed that too. I was like, yeah, that's what I want to see. <clears throat>
That's just Gojo. <laughs> mm hmm. Of course. Girls liked him. He looks so cool. Here, yeah, have a snack, Itadori. <laughs> Appear. Oh. <clears throat> Yeah, where's Itadorian's other guy, right? Nice back. <laughs> <laughs> Hammer time. Right? Get something that covers your body if you want. Don't want anyone to see your back. Mm -hmm. Oh, you have Jujutsu Stroll. Yeah, hello. Skip. Ha, <laughs> 
What the fuck? Okay, that was the episode. Let me know what you think. But yeah, I'm I'm a bit confused. Like, uh, the guys that came from I guess Mahito are they after the finger or are they after Itadori? I guess they are after the finger. But do they even need to care right now? Because it seems like um, uh, Nobara said that he would go towards the finger. But does he even need to get the finger? Because Ultimately, they want that Itadori eats them, right? So, since Megumi has a finger right now, that would mean Itadori already has a finger, basically, right? Because Megumi can just give it to Itadori and Itadori eats it and bam, solved. <clears throat> or maybe they want to get the finger and do something with the finger, maybe? I don't know. That's the confusing part. If they are after the finger or if they are after Itadori, because sometimes they're after the finger and they're after or not sometimes but they're always after the finger and after itadori basically and i mean they already let itadori have some fingers that they kind of like planted right i guess the uh, uh, first time they fought like a special great curse like this one here i think the first time they kind of said that they planted it so that itadori would get the finger right um and then yeah we got some megumi backstory I guess he. Uh, let me see. Let me see again. Um, da -dup -da -dup -da -dup -da -dup. So yeah, <clears throat> he kind of can't deal with good pe uh, with good people, and he also doesn't like bad people, <laughs> which is kind of conflicting, right? And I guess he also dislikes the fact that he kind of got pushed into this whole sorcerer thing, right? Um, I don't know. It, from what I got here, I, it seems like that Itadori is like a person that is basically like in a neutral position, right? He seems like he doesn't really care for anything because he also said like this whole sorcerer thing he doesn't like it because who should he protect right and he doesn't like good people and he did that or he doesn't get along with good people and he does doesn't like bad people um so it's like it seems like he's just like on his neutral path on his life and that's it now he got pushed into this sorcerer direction and he kind of always like holds himself back it seems like from what Gojo said. He never, he doesn't know how to like improve himself, do, do his best, utilize what he can do the best way. And it's just like very neutral for him it seems like. And so yeah, <clears throat> but is this like his ace up his sleeve, the domain basically? I can't imagine that right because um, Sukuna said that something special is, that there's something special about uh, Megumi, that he has like potential or whatever, um, but I don't think that it can be the domain that he was talking about because I guess at this point domains seem rather normal. It seems like that's something that can everyone can learn it, maybe. Maybe not every, everyone can do it because maybe it's something like, for an example, like Bankai and Bleach 
where you can learn it, it just is hard to learn, right? Not everyone maybe can learn it really because it's so hard to get. Um, but technically everyone could maybe do it if he spends enough time over there or whatever. Maybe it's not as hard in this show as in Bleach getting a bank Bankai. But maybe here it's like something everyone can do it, but it's hard, right, to get. And so I I would say that maybe well maybe it is something special. Maybe not maybe Jujutsu Jujutsu Sorcerer having a domain, maybe that is something special and maybe that's the ace or the special thing that Sukuna saw about Megumi, I don't know. But yeah. Um I guess we wrap this up next episode and all that stuff. And see how it goes what happens but yeah like i said at the, in the episode what i think is interesting is that since itadori and uh, sukuna made the pact he never came out and the one time that itadori asked him for help he is like nah i don't help you so that's something i think is very surprising that for like what how long has it been now like over 10 episodes easily i guess since that time I guess where they made the pact I thought that Sukuna would come out more frequently but no he didn't which is like I said interesting so I wonder when we will see him the next time coming out maybe next episode but I kind of doubt that I guess at this point so maybe season two at some point maybe I guess we will see but yeah I, I feel like I don't have much else to say to this episode really um, so, yeah, I guess that's it. But if you like what you saw, leave a like, subscribe, or comment, let me know what you think. Or if I missed something, you can tell me. But yeah, thanks for watching, until next time, bye-bye.